Chapter 1. The History of Dance. Egypt is a country steeped in history, with countless artifacts and ruins to back it up. One such marker of their past is the art of dance. Recorded dances found in Egypt date back all the way to 3300 BCE, marking dance as an integral part of their culture. The ancient Egyptians had a deep appreciation for the arts, and dance was just one example. Many of their dances were tied to religious ceremonies and celebrations, and were performed by both men and women. Some dances were even performed by the pharaoh himself. One of the oldest recorded dances is known as the Dance of the Revolving Men. This dance is depicted on a relief found in the tomb of the pharaoh Djoser, located in the Saqqara necropolis near Memphis. The relief shows a group of men in various stages of dance, with their arms extended and their robes flaring out behind them. It is believed that this dance was performed at the annual festival of Saqqar, a god associated with the necropolis. Another famous dance in ancient Egypt was the Dance of the Fishermen. This dance was performed in honor of the god Osiris, as he was believed to be the patron of fishermen. The dance consisted of a group of men mimicking the motions of paddling a boat and throwing their fishing nets. As they danced, they would chant a song in honor of Osiris. Despite being recorded so long ago, there is evidence to suggest that dance was an important part of everyday life in ancient Egypt. Many depictions of dance are found in both tombs and temples, suggesting that dance was not only a form of entertainment, but also a way to honor the gods and ancestors. The ancient Egyptians also recognized the importance of dance in physical fitness. Many of their dances involved acrobatic movements and impressive displays of athleticism. In addition, the regular practice of dance likely helped to improve their cardiovascular health and overall well-being. As time went on, Dance in Egypt continued to evolve and change with new influences. Greek and Roman dance styles began to make their way into Egyptian culture, creating a unique blend of styles that would continue to evolve over the centuries. Even today, dance remains a popular form of expression in Egypt, with traditional dances such as the tatab and the tanura still performed by skilled dancers. In conclusion, the rich history of dance in Egypt dates back thousands of years and is an important marker of their past. From religious ceremonies to everyday life, dance played a significant role in ancient Egyptian culture and continues to be celebrated in modern times. The recorded dances found in Egypt dating back to 3000 300 B.C. are a testament to the enduring power of dance as a form of expression and a part of human culture. Question, what are the earliest recorded dances? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2. The Benefits of Dancing As Karen walked into the dance studio for her first lesson, she couldn't help but wonder if she had made the right choice. She had heard about the physical benefits of dancing, but was not sure if it was for her. However, as the music started and she began to move, Karen felt a sense of joy and freedom she had never experienced before. As she continued her dance lessons over the next few weeks, Karen began to notice a change in her body. Her cardiovascular health had improved significantly, and she no longer felt winded after a flight of stairs. She also noticed an increase in her flexibility, as she was now able to touch her toes with ease. Watching herself in the mirror, Karen could see her muscle strength was improving with each class. Her posture had improved, and she felt a newfound confidence in her body. She was amazed at how dancing had helped her achieve physical benefits she never thought were possible. Over time, Karen also began to notice improvements in her mental health. Dancing had given her an outlet for stress and anxiety, and she found herself feeling more relaxed and at ease. The endorphins released during dancing also made her feel happier and more energetic, 
improving her overall mood. As she continued to practice and improve, Karen was excited to see what other benefits dancing would bring. She loved feeling strong, confident, and full of energy, and knew that she had made the right decision to try something new. As Karen finished her dance class for the day, she thanked her instructor and headed home, feeling grateful for the amazing physical and mental benefits that dancing had brought into her life. She was excited to continue her journey and couldn't wait to see what else was in store. Question, what are some physical benefits of dancing? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 3, Popular Dance Styles Latin dance had become increasingly popular in recent years, with salsa, bachata, and tango taking center stage in dance competitions all over the world. Samantha was particularly drawn to salsa, with its fast-paced, energetic movements that required both strength and finesse. She had always been a natural dancer, but it wasn't until she started taking salsa lessons that she truly found her passion. As she practiced her turns and spins with her partner, Samantha felt the music flow through her body, moving her in ways she had never imagined. The intricate footwork and complex patterns challenged her, but she was determined to master the dance. Her instructor was impressed with her progress and encouraged her to try other Latin dances as well. One of the most popular was bacata, a sensual dance that involved close body contact and fluid movements. Samantha was hesitant at first, but soon found herself getting lost in the music and the embrace of her partner. Tango was another dance that piqued Samantha's interest. Known for its elegance and sophistication, it required a certain level of precision and control that she admired. She worked hard to perfect the intricate steps and exaggerated movements that made the dance so captivating. As she continued her journey into the world of Latin dance, Samantha met other dancers who shared her passion. They would often practice together, stepping out of their comfort zones and trying new styles that pushed them to their limits. One evening, Samantha was invited to participate in a salsa competition with a group of dancers she had met at a local studio. She was nervous at first, but as the music started and she began to move, all her fears vanished. The crowd cheered as Samantha and her partner flawlessly executed their routine, their bodies moving in perfect synchronization. They had worked tirelessly on their choreography, and it showed. When the music ended, they took a bow, exhausted but exhilarated. As they walked off the dance floor, Samantha felt a sense of pride and accomplishment that she had never experienced before. She had found her calling in Latin dance and was excited to continue exploring all that it had to offer. From salsa to bacata to tango, each dance style had its own unique challenges and rewards. But through it all, Samantha discovered a newfound confidence in herself and her abilities. She knew that no matter what the future held, she would always have the rhythm of the music to guide her. Question, what are some popular Latin dance styles? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 4, The Culture of Hip-Hop Dance Hip-Hop dance had its origins in the African-American and Latino communities of the Bronx, New York, in the 1970s. It was a cultural movement that celebrated music, dance, fashion, and art, and it quickly spread throughout the city and beyond. For many young people living in the Bronx at that time, hip-hop dance was a way to express themselves and their experiences. They drew inspiration from a variety of sources, including African traditional dances, martial arts, and funk and soul music. At the heart of hip-hop dance was a sense of community and belonging. Young people would gather in parks, schools, and community centers to share their love of dance and music. They formed crews and competed against each other in competitions, showcasing their skills and creativity. The cultural movement of hip-hop dance also had a political dimension. It was a way for young people to express their frustration with social and economic inequality, 
and to call attention to the issues facing their communities. As hip-hop dance grew in popularity, it began to influence mainstream culture in America and around the world. The music and fashion associated with hip-hop became iconic, and the dance styles evolved and diversified, incorporating elements of jazz, ballet, and contemporary dance. Despite its widespread popularity, hip-hop dance has never lost its roots in the African-American and Latino communities of the Bronx. It continues to be a powerful force for artistic expression and social change, and it has inspired countless dancers to find their own voices and tell their own stories through dance. For many young people growing up in the Bronx today, hip-hop and dance remains a vital part of their culture and identity. They continue to gather in parks and community spaces to share their love of dance and to create new forms and styles that push the boundaries of what is possible. As the cultural movement of hip-hop dance enters its fifth decade, it remains a symbol of creativity, resilience, and empowerment. It has inspired generations of dancers, musicians, artists, and activists, and it will continue to shake the cultural landscape for years to come. Question, what is the significance of hip-hop dance? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 5. Dance Around the World Dance is a universal language that transcends boundaries and cultures. Every country has its unique traditional dances, and India is no exception. India is home to a diverse range of traditional dances, each with its own distinctive style and history. Bharatanatyam, Kathak, and Kuchipudi are among the most famous traditional dances of India. Bharatanatyam is a classical dance form from the south of India, and it is believed to be more than 2,000 years old. The dance is characterized by its intricate footwork, hand gestures, and facial expressions. Radhika grew up in Chennai, India, and learned Bharatanatyam from a young age. She fell in love with the art form and dedicated herself to mastering it. Her talent and dedication soon caught the attention of renowned Bharatanatyam dancers who invited her to join their dance company. Radhika's love for dance drove her to Kathak, a classical dance form from the north of India. Kathak is known for its fast footwork and spins, and it tells stories through dance. Radhika found the dance form challenging, but she was determined to explore its intricacies. Years later, Radhika moved to Hyderabad, where she discovered Kuchipudi, a classical dance form from the state of Andhra Pradesh. Kuchipudi is characterized by its dynamic movements and use of percussion instruments. Radhika was struck by the energy and passion of Kuchipudi and began training in the dance form. As Radhika grew in skill and experience, she began to appreciate the beauty and depth of traditional Indian dances. She recognized the importance of preserving these art forms and promoting them to the world. Radhika established her dance company, combining the three traditional dance forms into a unique blend that showcased their beauty and diversity. She traveled the world with her dance troupe, captivating audiences with their performances. Radhika's mission was to spread awareness of Indian culture and its rich traditions. She believed that dance was a powerful tool for promoting cultural exchange and fostering mutual understanding between different countries and cultures. Radhika's performances were met with enthusiastic applause and appreciation. She was invited to perform at international festivals and cultural events in countries such as the United States, the United Kingdom, and Australia. Despite the challenges and obstacles that Radhika faced as a female artist in a male-dominated industry, she persevered, driven by her love for dance and her desire to share its beauty with the world. Today, Radhika is recognized as one of the most talented and innovative dancers in India. She continues to explore new ways of blending traditional Indian dance forms with contemporary styles, and her work has inspired countless young artists to embrace their cultural heritage and express themselves through dance.
Question, what are some traditional dances from India? Check the video description.